Hello everybody, welcome to this video on how to add cell return in ProKeep. A cell return simply refers to a situation where a customer had purchased something from you but needs to return it and you need to refund the cash. That's what the cell return implies. To do this, you'll be logged in and docked to your dashboard and then you locate and click on your POS sales. On your POS sales page, you'll need to locate that particular transaction. I have one like that. The invoice number is 0006. So you look at that particular transaction and go to the action prompt and click on it. The drop down menu appears. You scroll down to sell return and click on it. My sell return invoice page appears and every individual product item this customer bought appears with the quantity. This customer bought a, ba a, a bag of filler at this amount and this customer and he also bought four pieces of flour. But he has returned two and he wants refund for them. So I simply come here under return quantity and I type in two is due 56,000 naira and I click on save I have performed one part of the cell return having done that I return back to my POS cell I return back to my POS sales page and you see here that there's a cell return on this transaction. So I'll go up to the menu on top of the page and click on cell return. What has happened is that quantity of product has been returned to my stock. Now I need to return the money to the customer, the funds. So this is the status of this present cell return. Payment is due to the customer. So I click on due, add payment, and then that is the 56,000 and save. So now I can conveniently return the funds to that customer and then the status of my cell return has been changed to paid. Thank you. I hope it was simple and straightforward. Brokeep your business growth partner.